Hello and welcome to another Performance Architects How-To. Performance Architects is a business and technology consulting company that helps companies initiate and sustain big changes in their performance management and business intelligence environments and process. This video along with others on our channel should help provide some additional insight as you embark on or continue along your EPM and BI journey. Head over to our channel after this video or come back in the future to learn best practices, hear overviews, and take part in lessons we have designed to help you. We are focused on continuing to develop this community and we welcome any recommendations you might have for future content. Thanks and enjoy. Hello and welcome to Performance Architects How To. My name is Viral. In this How To, I'll discuss on creating a planning schema to the topology manager within ODI. Just a quick background on the ODI tool. It is a Java based integration tool that supports multiple technology and provides standard support or drivers to connect to most tools. In order to launch ODI, you need to have a client based installation on your local computer or you could simply install it on the planning server. Once installed, you could launch ODI and navigate to the topology manager and expand on Hyperion planning technology to start working on how to create a planning schema. Let me walk you on how to create a planning schema in ODI. Once your ODI tool has been launched, simply navigate to the topology tab, expand technologies, right click Hyperion planning, select new data server, for the purpose of the demo, I'll say the name of the data server as test. If you are working on the ODI tool on your server, you could simply type in localhost. Or if you are launching it from your local computer, you could type in the name of the planning server, followed by the port number, which is always constant at 1133. Also, you need to provide your admin credentials. Once you click on save, it'll prompt you to register a physical schema. To create your physical schema, simply navigate to your data server, right click, select new physical schema. The physical schema contains important information such as the name of your planning application under the application catalog. You also need to provide the name of the database of the planning application under the work catalog. Once you click on save, you need to start connecting your physical architecture to your logical architecture. The logical architecture holds a placeholder in order to connect your ODI interface as your source or your target data store. In order to create a logical architecture, you need to right click Hyperion Planning under Logical Architecture, select New Logical Schema. For the purpose of demo, the name will be test. Everything has been launched under the global context. I'll select test as my physical schema. Click on save. Once you click on save, it'll automatically push the logical schema test for the, for the physical schema as well. This is how you create a planning schema in ODI. Thank you for joining and please visit our Performance Architects how-to channel for other videos on enterprise management and business intelligence solutions.